so you see what I've been telling you It's nothing like it seems It's what I've been telling you Oh, you'd learn what I mean if you came But the risk are you living it day? So welcome back everyone, Mike here, and I also want to welcome all the uh, new subscribers to the channel. Over the last couple days we've had probably, I don't know, six or seven thousand people that have become subscribers, which is really cool. We had a couple videos that really took off and it brought a whole bunch of people in. Now if you're new to the channel, I'll briefly tell you what our channel is all about. Uh, we're located in Pennsylvania. We have a large wooded property and we're into uh, kind of the finer things in life, like cutting firewood. We have a sawmill, we're always building stuff or doing projects. And normally, every video that we do is something that we're doing here on the property. I don't normally make videos just to make videos, but today is an exception to that rule. See, I was in the garage kind of cleaning up, and I came across a crossbow bolt, right? It was kind of just laying there on the workbench. I was going to put it away with the other ones. And then I find these chainsaw chaps. Now, <clears throat> now if you've been around for a while, uh, last year, I think it was, I did two videos with these chaps. These are steel Promark chaps, the good ones, and I tested them out with a steel 036, my favorite chainsaw. It's an old one. Running it wide open, and I hit these chaps with it, and it stopped it instantly. <laughs> Then, a couple weeks later, uh, somebody said that electric chainsaws, battery powered chainsaws, the chainsaw chaps would not stop them. So we did another test on that, which it did stop them. Stopped it instantly. And so I'm cleaning up the garage. I'm like, we're going to throw these things out tonight. And, I'm, you know, I have the crossbow bolt. I've got the chaps. Put two and two together. We're going to see if those chainsaw chaps will stop a crossbow bolt. And my initial feeling is I don't think it will at all. I think it will rip right through it. So I have a field point and a broadhead. We're going to try them both and see how it shakes out before I pitch those chaps. So the crossbow that we'll be using, this is an older 10 point. I've had that for probably, I don't know, eight or nine years, something like that. It shoots probably around 300 feet per second, something like that. Not near as fast as some of the new ones, but still, it's firing these bolts pretty fast. Now we're gonna try both a field point and a broadhead. What I'll do first, I'll just shoot one shot into the target, try to give you an idea how hard it hits. Then we'll hang the chaps in front of it. I want it to kind of hang loose and just kind of blow in the wind there a little bit and see what happens. All right, we're only about 12 yards away. I'm just gonna fire a field point into the target. You can see how hard it hits. All right, now we're going to try the field point through one leg of the chainsaw chaps. Now, like I said before, 
my gut feeling is it's going to rip right through it. Chaps aren't designed, you know, they're not like a bulletproof vest or something like that. The way they stop a chainsaw is all those little fibers tangle everything up. So I do think the field point's going to rip right through it. And if it does, we may try going through, you know, both legs of it and see what happens then. All right, here we go. All right, now we're gonna try the broadhead. All right, I think we can safely assume the uh, broadhead's gonna rip right through it since the field point did. Like nothing. All right, now we'll try the broadhead at 50 yards. These are cheapos, thank goodness. By the way, when I decided to try this, I searched on YouTube for crossbow versus chainsaw chaps. And believe it or not, out of all the millions and millions of videos on YouTube, nobody had tried that before. But anyway, there you have it. Uh, chainsaw chaps are definitely designed to stop a chain on a chainsaw, not a crossbow. But anyway, like always say, if you enjoy these videos, please hit the like button, click subscribe, and share them with your friends. I'm going to go back clean the garage.